Welcome back, welcome back, babies. It's your girl AJ, the owner of AJ Unique Creations, baby. What's good? What's good? As you guys can see, I'm in my bedroom. I'm not in the office. Today is Sunday, December 24th. So guess what? It's Christmas Eve. Happy Christmas Eve. Um, so actually, I was gonna post this week, but I decided to post, and I just decided to actually just do like a business talk. 2024 is approaching, and like just plans and goals. Because I want to come back and look at this next year around the same time and, you know, see have I achieved my goals for the whole 2024. You get what I'm saying? Like, this year, 2023, has been amazing. I love every second of it. I have learned new techniques. I have learned new things. I have taught myself new things that I never thought I would do. I never taught... I, like, never thought I'd be able to do a prom dress. And I have actually succeeded doing a prom dress. So, like... I guess this is my 2024, um, what is that, um, what should I call it, um, what is it called, um, my billboard, it's no, it's not called billboard, <laughs> oh my, like, my board, when you put your pictures in, this is like a video diary for it, I guess, is what you could say, so, I'm gonna say that, it's like my, um, my goals and my benefits, my manifestation of 2024, like, for 2024, um, I plan for my business to grow more than what it have grew this year. My business have grew since I started my brand. This year, I feel like I accomplished so much. My business is just, it's crazy. And I want to devote more of my time. All my time is to my business and my kids. So, I do feel like I could go farther in the future. Like, I have so many goals. Um, but I'm going to start with the first one is to grow my business more and when I mean grow just get more customers from around the world as a business you don't want the same customers I feel like for like no more I don't want the same customer you know to be my only customer like I will I love loyalty customers that's always come back I love that but I also want to grow I want customers that's in Germany India like I want them customers like I want to expand I want to be literally worldwide I want my business to be a worldwide business not just the United States Texas thing I want to sit here and say I have shipped every place in the United States baby that's what I want my business to be and that's kind of what I want second thing I want to hit like six figures in my business next year. This year, what did I hit? Okay, y'all yeah, want to hit six figures in my business or hit a million dollars in my business for a whole year. Like, not even like in a month. I want to make like a million dollars in a whole year or at least at the end of the year make six figures around the same time next year. <laughs> if you get what I'm saying. Um, third... I want to sell more prom dresses so this year I made a prom dress but like I told you guys I'll be giving that prom dress away so actually tomorrow is, I'm gonna announce the like information about the prom dress and put it on my social media about the prom dress that I made that I'll be giving away for prom season of 2024 but next year I want to have at least made about three prom dresses that I will sell most likely be probably pre-made designs that's up for sale on my website but i want to make three because i know that i could do prom dresses and i have made it and i have seen it come out beautiful and amazing and um it's like what's stopping me like what's stopping me from making dresses besides me myself and i'm I, I truly, that's just the way I am. And I do believe that, like, what's stopping me is me, myself, and I. Nobody is stopping me from making prom dresses. If it's something I want to do, I have to do it. I can't keep putting it behind and keep saying, okay, I'm going to do it. I'm just going to make one and call it a day. No, because it's the point that I know that I could do it. That's the issue. I know that I could do it. So it's like, why? Like, I be looking at myself like, AJ, like, I look at the prom dress that I made and I'm about to post pictures of it, whatever. I'm going to actually find a picture and put it somewhere in here of the prom dress that I made probably right here. Um, but it's like, I'm holding myself back. 
and I don't want to hold myself back from anything that I could do my business is not just just clothing of custom clothing and I be trying to get people to understand that like my business is much more than something so simple in your mind is so simple but it's not and my mind my business is so big and you guys don't see it nobody sees it but in my mind i'm the only one that sees it and i know it sounds crazy but 2024 i want to make sure i at least have made three unique dresses by hands with my hands and sold them myself that right there making a prom dress this year was it was amazing um i i learned a lot in that and i learned and in the day i could do this like girl you got some skills up on you sometimes i be forgetting my skills that's how i feel i be forgetting my skills but i did learn like you got skills and you can do it so that's two third i want to go on some more vacations i feel like i haven't went on vacations this year and that is because my husband was deployed half of the year he was deployed for like nine and a half months so I didn't go on vacations. I was just home with my kids. So next year, I want to go out a little bit more. Go to, go to trips. I want to take you guys with me. I want to go to these places. I want to go to Vegas. I definitely want to go to Vegas next year for my birthday. So I want to um just do more trips. Family trips as a family and everything like that. Just because this year, it was, you know, waiting on my husband to come home. We was home all the time. We didn't go anywhere. It was, just, it was a crazy nine and a half months. If you have a military husband, then you understand. It was it was crazy. Um, then the fourth thing is me. I want to focus on me more. I want to show you guys the side of me that y'all don't ever see. But I want to get into the you era like you girl like you that girl era i'm gonna um get into that i'm gonna go back to get my nails done and stuff like that being a mom you do forget about that and i have forgot about that i'm not gonna lie i have forgot about the nails the hair being a mom you do forget about this so i kind of want to get back into it and remember like girl you that girl <laughs> you was that girl before you had kids you that girl still you know what i'm saying like I, don't forget that and I want to buy a new car I, and the thing is it's not even like a particular car but I want a new car and for me it's like I want a new car with money that I made for my business not no loans and all of this I want to sit here and like I put money down that I made for my business. This is my working money. At the end of the day, that's a different feeling when you get your car and you buy a car and it's like, this is my money. This is mine. Okay? Like, I earned this. I could do what I want. So, that's like another goal. And last, I do want to work on my credit. I want to get like an 800 credit. <laughs> that's going to take some time. But I want to start like focusing on that literally um i'm 25 you guys so i'm 25 and it's time to think about the adult stuff in my life that i want to do because i want to work on business loans in the future definitely next year because next year will be what four years of business oh my gosh next year 2024 it's gonna be four freaking years i've been in business like i've been doing this on my own me myself and i no help nobody pressing shirts just me y'all see it every day that i've been doing this and i've been working my behind off at the same time being a mom so i want to like do business loans and get into that part of the business part that is it's scary to think about business credit business loans but it's like i have to at the end of the day if i'm gonna just, you know thrive in my business i eventually have to think about that but i'm ready for 2024 i i have my goal set so at the same time next year and i'm talking to the future me that's gonna look back and watch this girl you better have this enough on that list you better have made it somewhere on that list because you didn't be fighting you bet have okay you 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 could have got so far so do not go backwards god don't ever give you something in life that you cannot handle and i tell myself this every day so when you sit here and you want to give up don't you ever because guess what he gave his toughest battle to his strongest soldiers so it ain't no giving up this ain't no quitting it's none of that you pick yourself back up and you get up and you do this another day and this is for my future self, a note to my future self when I look back and I watch this. And whoever watching this, this is a note to you. Don't stop. 
Life is hard. Running a business is hard. Set the goals that you want for your future. Set it and achieve it because I, three years in business, the goals I have set for myself, I feel like it may take me a year to get it. But then they, when I look back and I tell myself, oh my gosh, I did what I wanted to do. I did it. I, the biggest, like the biggest, biggest thing this year for me, I made a dress that I never thought that I could do. Yet everybody in my family was like, you could do it, my husband. You could sew, what are you doing? And I remember somebody told me this year, they was like, it is in you. I could tell you, it's in you. And I didn't believe it. <laughs> Excuse me. And they was like, they didn't even know me either. And they like, they texted me on TikTok and it was like, it's in your blood. It's in you. Take it serious. I love getting them notes like that. Um, So, I believe that. It's in me. Like, so when I made that dress this year, it showed me so much about myself and what I could do if I actually just do it. Also, for next year, I know I asked you guys and some of you guys said no, um, but I will be bringing back the body butter. And that is because my kids is anemic. That one made me start the body butter in the beginning. When I started my business, I did body butter. My kids is anemic. Not anemic. <laughs> They have eczema. I'm sorry, I'm confusing everything. They have eczema, not anemic. They have eczema and their skin flare up a lot. And that would make me start my body butter. And when I did it, I made when I made it, I gave two away for free. And the two people I gave it to, their kids had eczema. And they used to come back and buy so much because they said it was the only thing that worked. My body butter, body butter was like all natural. So I just wanted to bring it back because it helped my kids and it did help people. And why not? Because I don't see myself as a small business. Just like Louis Vuitton and all of them, they sell perfume, clothes, bags and all. That's going to be me. I'm not settling. I'm not going to be in a box. AJ Unique Creations is not in a box. Keyword, unique. I'm unique in every single way. I'm I'm the way that God has made me. I'm unique in every way. So my business is unique. It's not one thing. It's a thousand things that you could never guess what I make. <laughs> and spend time with my kids more. I'm gonna get them more involved. They want to be on YouTube, but I do feel like my kids is too young to be having their faces all plastered through here for you guys. But they want to be involved in it because they always in my office with me and helping me. So I'm going to try easing them into things. I don't even want to have them plaster in there because they're kids at the end of the day. But if they want to, you know, I let them say hey or whatever like that. But just be, um, just take my kids out more. Have more family time. Um, I think that's it. So those are my goals of 2024. Those are my plans for my business and me as a person and my family. And I hope you guys enjoyed your Christmas. Happy Christmas Eve. And I'll see you guys next week. <laughs> that would be New Year's. So I hope you guys enjoy your Christmas. Enjoy the time with your family. Take time for your family. And we'll see what we'll be making next. Because we got a couple things to work on next. I'm going to tell you guys that now. We already got orders and we got a couple things to work on. But we are on Christmas break at the moment. But we will be back. And I'll see you guys next time. So make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.